Thank you very much. 602 on your Saturday morning. New from overnight, one person is dead, another person with life-threatening injuries after a minivan collided with a sweeper truck overnight here in Lexington. That crash shut down Newtown Pike near I-75 for close to five hours while police investigated. Bonnie Campo joins us now live from the scene with details. Morning, everyone. While the street has just opened, police are still on scene right now because they're trying to direct traffic. So they've opened up the ramp and we're going to give you a live look of what is going on currently here at I-75 and Newtown Pike. Police right here, they're still got the vehicles on scene that were involved in this deadly crash, trying to clear that up. But traffic is going inbound and outbound at this point. What we have learned is that that minivan had T-boned a street cleaner. Police say that one of them might have run a red light. And police say the minivan was heading outbound on Newtown Pike whenever it hit the sweeper truck that was turning from the interstate onto Newtown Pike. Officials say Vincent Farr was the driver of that van and died on scene. And all we know about far at this point is the coroner says that he's from Missouri, 35 years old, but no details about the passenger that was in that minivan. Uh, so right now we're not sure what what dealings he had here in Lexington, if any. Maybe he was just traveling through, I'm not really sure, but um, we're going to try to talk with the, um, the friend that's at the uh, medical center and kind of put the story together a little bit, but that's pretty much all I know right now. We are told the driver of the sweeper truck was also taken to the hospital but suffered only minor injuries. Covering the news live in Lexington from the LEX 18 Mobile Newsroom, back to you.